Ooh, frozen lands. Nice. Already. Already a good choice there. Um, we're going without... Uh, um, political system, because I murdered them all anyway. I remember that part. And we're doing 800% or art conversion. Maybe we get 700 food? Nice. I like food. Hey Fabian, I'm late. Well, maybe you're already. I must be put a chip in my head soon. I doubt it. You know, I still have a word to say about that. But yeah, we defended here, then went to the swamps. Okay, now we're getting up there. And slowly making our way through. Interestingly enough, state 12 isn't put on the map anywhere. Unless I miss, I'm not seeing it. After walking for several hours in a long dark cave, you finally manage to get out. Outside, it snows and the air is cold. You understand then that you arrived at the top of Mount Olympus too. Not surprisingly, you can see an incalculable number of zombies around you. We're still in front of you stands a gigantic entrance. Even the light of day fails to illuminate the thick darkness of what is inside. Above this entrance, panels in the shape of letters are hung on the rock of the mountain. You can read the acronym HOPE, followed by Centaur for research and final experimentation. But the more you look at this entrance, the more familiar it looks to you. If you've seen it somewhere before, probably in the visions. Information about the state. Close to a huge chop complex in the Mount Olympus 2, this complex is composed of facilities that clone infected faster and faster. At the beginning of the state, all the facilities are deactivated. By the fortune teller, will try to repair each type of facility as fast as she can. First facilities will be repaired soon. The other one will be repaired between 15 to 5 days. Each facility will produce growing waves that you must destroy to stop the spawn from a targeted facility. Destroying the facility before the fortune teller repaired it will prevent infected to spawn near this facility. Okay. Repairing those facilities, the fortune teller will call her children. From day 2, expect more powerful waves. But several thousand infected in late game every 7 days. However, you will be able to block the waves at a certain price of food. Except the first one that will show you where the infected come from. If you don't have enough food to heal you up, you won't be able to use your power. Okay. The 65, a massive horde of 10,000 infected will attack you if you do not achieve to destroy the facilities. If you hold the last onslaught, the status one. So, either we destroy all facilities or, you know, kill 10,000 infected. PC. Finally, the Mount Olympus 2 offers a few resources to exploit and food, especially in difficult and hardcore will become a real long-term problem for the colony. You'll need to use the convoys to import food and continue to develop your colony and recruit units. If you don't, your colony will fall. However, two storage areas have been detected and you will find extra resources when you take control of the warehouses. It might not be enough to hold back the infected. But so... Concrete, man. Oh, peace, you know. Healthy. You already settled on a name. Well, I mean, I guess we'll, we'll give it a try. Jonathan Smith takes you part of the group. Commander, ever since we started climbing Mount Olympus, I have the strange feeling that I've seen you somewhere, as if we've already met here. I don't know how or why. I don't know where we could have met each other, but I've got a question for you. What's the Phoenix experience? As far as I remember, the Phoenix experience was the final experience of, well, the Phoenix project. So what's the Phoenix project? The project was about cloning a brain into a virgin human body. By virgin, I mean a human body that doesn't have any experience, any thoughts, any education, anything. Reminds me of the IDG project that you told me about, Sylvia. 
Indeed, it appears to be the exact same project, but with a different name. Suddenly have a vision. The vision is blurry. Around you, you recognize his cousin. Corridor full of capsules. Was the one you saw in your vision when you discovered Jonathan Smith in the Hope Research Center in the desert. You hear an alarm and an echo. You keep going down the corridor. You see sparks of bullet impact on the ceiling, but also on the walls. Some bullets break the protective glass of the capsules. On your left, you see a young woman, his face full of blood. On your right, you see a woman who appeared to be in her 40s. You're looking at her as these two people carry you with one of your arm on their shoulders. Your eyesight improves slightly, then you recognize the woman. It was Felicia Teller, Aka, AK, the fortune teller. You try to struggle to get off her, but your body doesn't react. Grace did not express the assurance she displayed when she spoke to you in the marshes. Here you read fear, terror. Suddenly you feel intense pain in the leg. Hurry, said Felicia Teller, looking at the man covered in blood. We're almost there, the storage area is not far away. Then Felicia looked at you. She looked at you with surprise and spoke again to the person on your left. Phoenix wakes up. We must hurry before Kustra gets his hands on it. Go. Felicia rested his gaze on you while smiling. Hang on, Phoenix. Please, hang on. Um, The custom campaigns are different, yeah. They usually don't have the downsides of the hero or the swarm missions, like, and then uh, most of them have different, different um, goals every mission, so that's really nice. You guys better tell me what's going on with the commander. It has been a while. I suspected you were hiding something from us. It's not the first time the commander has lost consciousness and I see you all together speaking in the shadows. Nobody knows what's going on. I demand an explanation. What is going on with the commander? How can the fortune teller control Jonathan? It's a long story. Oh boy. Commander James is right. At least he needs to know what's going on. So we'll begin her story. She explained to James that she knew Joss Jester and Malek Fritzen for a long time, since they lived together in the last human colony of Europe. She also revealed to him when Kustra, the leader of this colony, was also the CEO of Hope that he lived several hundred years without anyone knowing how and had to contact with Quintus Green. Confessed to James that she had joined Empire City um, and was a double agent in the Quintus government so that she could find out why Quinn and Quintus were in contact and how. She revealed the existence of a project, the IDT, in the intracerebral duplication and transplantation and explained to James that his project aimed to make Quintus immortal by transplanting the mind and brain into the body version of all past. And yet you were brought to Quintus and this one was excited to begin the final experimentation with you, like if you were the final piece of the puzzle. Then she explained the complex relationship of Jonathan and Felicia, who became over time the fortune teller. It seems that both also lived several hundred years and that Jonathan would be Infected by the creeping plan, but the worst part is everyone on Ashgard is also infected with the creeping plan, and the fortune teller would eventually control everyone. Damn, that's a lot to deal with. But what is happening to the commander? Everything began before we met Malek. Do you remember? Yes, I do. You knew a wave was coming, and you lost consciousness a few times. Explain to James Neal what happened to you. So, if I understand this whole story, you can hear the fortune teller's voice that told you to join her and you saw her in your recent vision. Is it me or do you have the impression that the commander is much more than an instrument of war for Quintus? We don't have time to speculate on what the commander is or isn't for the Emperor. We'll see that when the time comes. For now, we need to secure this cold and paper place. Always pushing it off. Never time to, you know, figure these things out. Um, so far it's been pretty nice. I, yeah, I took a break from it, but now all the maps are released, so we're trying to play through it all. A uh, woman is coming out from the huge cavern. I also forgot that there were the envoys, so good thing we got reminded. I have to admit this place is not as beautiful as Ravenclaw Bottom Bridge, but the Mount Olympus too reminds a beautiful place. You again? The harpies killed you. 
You are the perfect example of the limits of human condition. For you, when you see someone die, no longer exists. How can you still think that when humanity has been able to duplicate and spread the mind of its own kind? Are you talking about the Phoenix Project? Oh, I think I double clicked too fast. We will soon discover that this world is populated with similarity. Well, if you survive long enough for that. But I'm sorry, I need to leave you here with my children. My plans are changing a little bit as Queen Costa is not a major issue anymore. On the attack, my children. Hundreds of hundreds of infected suddenly came out of the cavern, heading to your colony. This is impossible to hold them back. We can't unrun them. We are surrounded. And be the end. I told you, Commander, you will be my child. And that's all of your people. You have no escape. No. Not the end. What the... Watch and Taylor looks around here, surprised to see the infected stop their assault. Attack them. Move. Move. Your head is hurting you badly. Yo, fresh flesh. You okay, bud? Watch and Taylor looks at you. No. You can't be it. That's impossible. Why did you? No. No, no, no. You must disappear from this planet. Uh, Fortune Teller ran into the cavern. Commander, what happened? How did you do that? You, you just stopped the infected. I don't know. I just told to myself that everything should stop and they stopped moving. Let's hope you can do this again. Your ability might be helpful sooner or later. For the Emperor? No, no, for, for Kensei. How are you doing? Good morning. You're now able to stop incoming threats, announce waves only, by using your power. A few hours before the count run of the announcement wave starts, you can force infected to stop their onslaught. A window will show up to ask you if you want to use your power. However, you will need medication to heal you up after using your power. The more days go by, the more important the treatment will be. The calculation of your power is done in the following way, A times 3. And see in the description of the commands and the current price of your power. Okay. Primary objective, destroy all facilities or survive the final wave. Mm, those are just the clues. Wait, can I build convoys? Oh, it says down here, current cost of... I don't know if you guys can see it. No, I'm in the way. Oh, oh cheers in the way. But it shows down here, current cost of your power, zero food. So, yeah. Maybe the uh, convoy show up later. Um, actually, take a look around. Facility is cloning walkers, runners, walkers, not walkers, walkers, walkers. Okay, storage area, storage area, Zetos. I guess, yeah, the further we get, the higher they spawn stuff. Spitters, mutants, oh boy, harpies, Zetos, giants. Okay, so the lovely little, little place. What? My machine is ready. Mutants will rule the world. Good morning, sir. Okay. I'm the freaking boss. Oh. Hello. Oh dear. Let go. This been pulling from both sides. Wow. Oh, I guess that's the food we get to disturb. Just let me finish my cigar. Okay. Building completed. Building completed. I present your mayor uh, candidates. The gold. Good morning, sir. My machine is ready. Where's the party? 
your service. Oh yeah. Where's the mouse? Doing some tenator scouting because you know he would pull too much. Oh. I was thinking we could put another um another formula there, but not at the base I wanted to, because it would block the stone, which is cool. Unless we put the stone up there. I actually don't know how much noise um, a Newton makes, because I usually don't use them. I feel like if the tenants are coming here, we might pull too much. Yes. Come on! Tell the mutant what to do. What the hell? Where does the scream come from? Hey, Wrecker Boy. Boss should produce less noise, but he's screaming all the time, maybe. This is the fortune teller. She becomes stronger each time we are getting closer to her. Careful, commander. But, but, we didn't get closer to her yet, did we? You are wrong, so weak. Is there iron somewhere to pick up? No. Mutants are the worst. Like they're coming from everywhere. Bombs coming up, yeah. Like not having rangers to scout stuff too. In real life? Well, uh, it's going to rain here actually soon. I don't know if today or tomorrow, but it's getting colder. I like it. Scout is the new. Yeah, the, like it's the only problem is it's really about far open here. Like it's hard to. Oh, look at that. There's. Executors could potentially use. For now, we still have food. What? Good morning. Does somebody need a beer? Our soldiers are 
in trouble. Is it too tired already? Building complete. Ready. I should be swatting away from. What can I do for you, sir? Sometimes mutant can be pretty nice. Continuous waves now? Yes. Already? I guess we need those. Tell the mutant what to do. Yes. Need to get to those executors, I guess, but I don't have oil to repair them actually, like even if I get there. Um I can't pay for them. And the mutant is slowly dying. Man of the Fortune has repaired the cloning facility to clone walkers. From now on, every six hours, growing waves of walker will spawn from there until we have destroyed those facilities. Units under attack. Good morning, mm. sir. Building completed. Okay. Yes. Oh, oh the Tenados is now pulling up here, which I should have used him instantly. Now he's pulling too much. Um. Is it tea time already? Let me destroy them. Nice idea. Gotcha. Just let me finish my setup. Trying to break into the building. That's all. Cool. Tell the mutant what to do. Get out of my way. Maybe it's just his noise that pulled all of that. Yes. What? Don't try to submit the mutant. Good. Anything to destroy? Yes. Units under attack. I'm out over. Tell the mutant what to do. Our forces are in danger. Yeah. Our colonies. I guess that's the other problem of mutants, like they don't mutants regenerate life. I don't like the world. At your service. Anything to destroy. Our soldiers are in trouble. Well what do you want? An autograph? Is there right. iron somewhere? Let's go! Units under attack. Okay, at least that's close. But it might pull stuff from the other side. Oh, they're in here again. What? Understood. Hello? Our forces are in danger. Speak, pathetic human. Good. Anything to destroy? Okay, next Come time we on. need to clear this ASAP, basically. What? Good. Good. Yeah. Come on! Speak, my fatted human. Anything to destroy? Mutants oh, kill those and then future. some snipers. Eventually up. Good. So I think upkeep costs for an executor is like 40 gold or something. Understood. Yes, it's a wonderful day, don't you think? Tell the mutant what to do. Stop running past my mutant. Come on! Ernest disciple. Our forces are in danger. Yes, 
Christ, that's a misplaced one. No. Oh, hello. Have a taste of my machine. Feel the wrath of the Titan. Yes. Hello. Let's go. You are all so weak. Really want that iron up there. There we go. Excuse me. That we might finally be able, you know, to get some snipers to support all this madness. Any rocks? Come and you are able to use your power. No. Yeah. Well, maybe we should have. Yes. But the wave itself wasn't big last time. Like. Tell the mutant what to do. Attention. Oh dear. On my way. Oh, let's get sniper tech. I still want to clear this south side, but yeah, we're kind of busy all the other sides right now. Oh, well, once we have more stone, we can also build a market. Oh, it doesn't show where the waves are coming from or when, or it just haven't spawned yet. My freebie made enough noise to pull everything now. That would be nice. Wait, I had cottage tech all the time? I need to get that. Oh, it doesn't matter, we're gonna use it. like there's no farming on this map so far so oh boy i guess that's the wave i got that one but to avoid black music it doesn't show up to avoid black music ah okay But music. Well, I went to warehouse here, so I don't know if block that. Probably should have left some space there too for building stuff. Let's 
on the south side so we can, you know, work with that. Seems like there's only what, this entry point, so once we have all this secured, we don't have to wonder or worry about the side entry points anymore. Hopefully. more stone. Reserves are pretty good. Well, not pretty good, but you know, we could use some. Our soldiers are in trouble. Attention. Building completed. Building completed. Units under attack. Wait, there's chubbies in there now. another market here um i guess the bank has to wait a bit because we don't have enough stone for that right now We have to secure this and then push one of those sides out. I couldn't select convoys earlier. Oh, I guess now we can. Like in the beginning? I don't know what triggers it. Oh, they don't cast stone. Nice. Wood burn. I want to build at least two. I need another warehouse we're currently building. Our soldiers are in trouble. Attention. Building completed. But thanks for the reminder of the convoys. I already forgot again. Yes. What can I do for you, sir? Units under attack. Still have iron to pick up now. Tell the mutant what to do. Because I need a market. Ah, okay. Being smart and all. Knowing these things. I, mean, I guess it is your campaign. You should know these things. Construction progress. How long do they need to get in? Twenty-four hours. 
So, roughly day 15. Yes. Good. 28 years later was from um, Pop, and this one is from Caress. They did, um, I think, as far as I know, they did help each other though, so. But it's different map makers. Damage. Man at a French teller has repaired cloning facilities that clone runners. From now, every six hours, growing ways of runners will spawn from there until we have destroyed this facility. Yeah. Okay. Oh, we still don't have the oil for this. Mainly for my energy. At least we're getting um, experience. Uh, no. I don't want to stop the wave. I don't have the food for that kind of shenanigans. Okay, century empire. Uh, and we need. So we need iron first. It is pretty great if map makers make different map difficulty settings, especially if they're not just you get a thousand more snipers or something in the beginning, but actually fine-tune waves and stuff. Like, yeah. I think that is really great if people do that and should be more appreciated. Anything to destroy? Good. Easy. Is there a path to go in Yes. Yeah. Good. I think Come those on. bigger stuff already know. Don't okay. try to submit the mutant. Well, we're pretty much out of food. I wonder if you, like, day one can just rush through the map. I guess we have to build one vehicle if we build two, so we need one and then two again, and then we can build the five. You have one day you can build this map. <laughs> that would be nice. Can the hero units die? Like, are they allowed to actually? It's getting harder and harder to get through here. Yes. My machine is ready. 
it. I feel like I should have just destroyed them because we're probably gonna defend further forward. I just wanted to see the prices of the construction, but I guess we can have to do that right now. gold. Can we store 250 iron? Actually, no. We need another warehouse somewhere. Okay. I'm not sure where we can sneak one in. Maybe somewhere here. Uh, it probably was the runaway, yeah. Don't know where exactly to build that. Sniper is ready. What are we missing? Seventy wood. Oh, ten iron. When convoys are overpowered, life was so much easier. I feel like, yeah, maybe rushing out with the mutant earlier is better. I think they were from the mayors if you used the political system. Yeah, boundary costs aren't too. Or something. But we could get oil and then repair those and also upgrade our quarries. Yes, it's a wonderful day, don't you think? The world looks so tiny 
money from up here. At your service. We can buy a beholder. Okay. He's not getting through there. Eventually, that's gonna be a while. Voice uh, and convoys, storm iron. Well, I don't know where to push yet. I guess that's the issue. And we need enough defense. I think I'm gonna wait out one more wave, and then we're gonna push somewhere. Kind of hard finding out where you can push it though. Hey bro. Humans, I show beauty. Sniper is ready. But yeah, I guess the, the issue is I don't know where, which path to push. I think the main wave came through here, so if we get past that, maybe we don't have to deal with that. But, like, there's nothing out here that seems worth claiming. That's why I have my defenses here, too. So, so far. Let's research oil. I mean, actually, we don't need him here anymore. Good kill stuff. Well, radar towers use iron too. I guess that's kind of the issue. to destroy units under Tell the mutant what to do die Thanks, Maurice. let's finally get that oil would you like just use it to stop the wave well we don't have the food to stop it so not like we have an option. I don't have oil to repair the executors. I could buy it, but you know, we're, we're close to harvesting it so yes. yeah, I don't like building the defenses here because they're always coming around the corner where we can't see them earlier close to this location? How? How is there enemies too close to build there? There's some zombies stuck in here, like it doesn't make sense. Yeah, permanent reduction in food to stop the wave if you have enough food. 
I wish you could see the waves coming because I don't know when they strike and then I miss it and then I don't know when my pushing time is. Well, first off we need more iron income. we need much more stone income right now so we might just save safety iron so we can build five time we need 250 and 4000 gold and the next time the convoy can back, comes back That's where they spawn. The radar tower up here. Like there's some stuff up there. I think that's the wave that's coming right now, right? Otherwise, there's no pushing for us. <laughs> You're too late then. I don't have food, I can't upgrade my houses. Excuse me? Just saving up for the last convoy and then... Is it tea time already? <laughs> 22 food, yeah. And I still need yeah. to build troops, like 22 Let's food. Go. Can't do much with that. Oh, Ready. Speak, pathetic human. Once the convoy is finished, we can get more food. It really annoys me that I can't build a thing here, like a wood tower. Need to get past this waves there so we don't have to deal with that anymore. Here we go. Oh, we're losing our taste of my machine. Yes. Die. That's a sick. Supposed to shoot the closest, they're just getting murdered by random walkers coming. I should have tried to get up here faster, I guess. Get this so we can get at least some titans and then we can push try pushing with them. I wanna get in here to deactivate that, I guess. They're making noise and pulling stuff from the other sides too. Speak, 
else would pay a rest for something like that. Oh, it's taking a lot of damage here. Yes. Convoys, we need food, please. Thank you. What? Anything to destroy? Morning, sir. Yes. Come on. Oh, we're pulling a ton of stuff from around the corner there. What can I do for you, sir? Feel the wrath of the Titan. Yes. Hello. And I'm out of workers too, so. Great. That's early workers. What? Don't waste the time of the mutant. Good morning, sir. Units under attack. Yes. I'm just like, you are wrong. Just taking too much damage there too. We need more troops, but then Don't I did all of this for nothing. To submit the mutant. The walls are under attack. Your sniper at your service. Yes. Yes. Oh, we dodged this wave. I guess there's constant wave, like, yeah. Just need to run. I should have pushed the defenses forward and then Speak dealt with this. Human. Oh dear. My machine is ready. So many targets gonna love it. Yes. Let's go. Oh, I still need more workers for the engineering center. I did clear out some standing on special sets too. Oh, okay. Oh, you that. Too easy. Okay, I'm getting down. Oh boy. Wave thingy coming. That's one one thing destroyed. But it should stop spawning here. Oh hello. Indeed. Oh hello. Indeed. So much steam. Yes. Anyway. Manner of Funding has repaired the clone fence to clone Tuxedus from now on every six hours. Well, Tell the mutant what to do. I'm a bit worried about this side here. Especially since I can't build towers here. I, I don't get it. Nor can I build walls there, like, otherwise I would just move it a bit further back. But, yeah. Let's go. 
What can I do for you, sir? Indeed. Let's go. Uh, a bit more gold and we can research. Okay. Can't build an executor tower here either. It's just silly. Missing a tower there? No. Thanks. Or nothing. I guess always going to be a weak spot then, I guess. The music got more intense. It says there's a zombie too close, but like he would have to be in the forest here, which there is none. Like we can build a lookout tower, I guess, but shouldn't be one. And a weak spot if you don't fall back to the spot. Oh, okay. Oh. First. There's one zombie stuck here, apparently. Look at that. Um, are we dead? Gonna try to kill it with the Tenatos potentially, but first we need to kind of survive. Well, which we might not be. that several scientists had disappeared. There's a leak of information. We are informed that the scientists were in fact guinea pigs for a project called Phoenix Project. It was Jonathan Smith and Felicia Teller who alerted us. They told us to run away while they went to look for the Phoenix experience. They quickly explained what this project was. This time, Queen Kustra went too far. Most scientists, like me, took up arms and started revolting against Kustra. The security responded and shot some of my colleagues. He could not stand it. So we released the infected onto them by controlling them with the climbing plant. Uh, we were not able to control them all at once and they started attacking everyone, even us. The security pounded the alarm. With a few dozen of my colleagues we headed to the storage area, but some infected stopped us. We took refugee here, but it's a dead end. Hello? I saw Felicia and Jonathan carrying someone a little further down the hall in front of us. I cannot tell if it's a man or a woman, but Jonathan seemed seriously injured. They went through the zombies as if they had become like them. I called them. Felicia turned around and I saw on her face that she was sorry. She continued her way to the storage area. At the same time, a bunch of guards shot zombies and chased them. You mean that Kustra wanted the ex... I assume you mean experiment with that. Alive. I understood that Jonathan and Felicia had taken someone important in the eyes of Kustra. Like, multiple times experience and experiment seemed to be mixed up. The Phoenix experiment... We shot the guards and the zombies at the same time to slow them down. Some guards responded by opening fire on us, but they quickly understood that we were finished. They continued to pursue Felicia and Jonathan. All of a sudden we heard Kustra in the speakers of the complex. He said, To all units, capture Felicia and Jonathan and kill them if necessary, but keep the Phoenix experiment alive. Zombies just destroyed the last barricade. I'm afraid of dying. I see them. They're coming. 
I deserve what's coming. We all deserve it. We've just destroyed the human race. We're building this world and we will destroy it. And us at the same time. May God forgive us. Reminds me of something I remember when we extracted the Phoenix Experiment from this lab. Jonathan looks at you. What's happening? I remember. I know who is the Phoenix Experiment. Who is it? It's it's you, Commander. Surprised face. I did some voice acting um, in one of the maps, and also some in um, Bob's maps. Like, what? What Jonathan says makes sense. Remember, Commander. Before we entered this complex, Jonathan felt like he knew you. And that would also explain why you're able to block the hordes of infected. Jonathan was telling the truth when we were at the Great Wall of Ashgard. You are infected with the climbing plant, and you would be, like some kind of central unit that controls the infected. What if the fortune teller knew about you from the beginning? Did she know who you really are? That would explain her determination to kill us as soon as we arrived with these organized zombies. It also adds something. Malik and I have chased the fortune teller from Europe to here, and we didn't know why she did this. And when you found us, you told us that you arrived here three or four months ago, like us. Like, she knew you were coming. How could she know that? I don't know. We will ask her when we've captured her. Discovered you are the Phoenix experiment, and that Felicia Teller and Jonathan Smith saved you from this complex a long time ago. Also, Felicia Teller knew you were coming to Ashgard. You are somehow connected to her. Finally, Jonathan was right. You are affected by the creeping plan. You learned stuff. Yes. Excuse me. Units under attack. Right. Mm. Oh, you're pulling these all over here. Yeah. Like a snake in spray. Understood. Speak. Yes. The mighty titan is here. I guess we do need more energy. We could get... We could secure more space, I guess. Or we just Good get the morning, advanced. Sir. There is, but we could also destroy this one. Excuse me? Tell the mutant what to do. At the Good storage morning, area sir. thing. Anything to destroy? Stuff. Let's do it, human. Our soldiers are in trouble. Jolly good. Building completed. You charge so unique. The mighty titan is here. Cool day to fly. Units on the There we go. Got the zombie. getting from this
Oh, no. Excuse me. Let's go. Attention. What? Building completed. Ready. Vote for your player. Um. Let's get the tight salary. Die. The mighty Titan is here. Attention. What can I do for Building you, completed. sir? Yes. Hello. Good morning, sir. I mean, our economy is getting a lot better right now since we reached one of the storage areas. I wonder if we can reach that from the backside actually, just. The titans there it might just be better want a refund no no refunds Is it, but that doesn't matter, that's good enough. What? Yes. No, we can worry about from taking out this facility. Slowly out of its comfort Don't zone. Waste the time of the mutant. Yes. Oh, you know a wave is about to come. You're able to use the power now. Hello. Understood. Yes. I don't actually know if we have enough. Those waves have been getting bigger and bigger. And again, we're not getting these side waves here anymore, so that's a lot better. It's automatically sold like that. Better stuff to do than manually do that. I feel like it might be easier to claim these things on that side, but I want to take out the mutant and the spitter spawn here. Oh boy. I guess that's the wave spawn thing. Oh. So, yeah, I guess I didn't plan on harpies. That prominent. Yes. 
The mighty Titan Die. is here. What would be nice would be global vision. I wonder how you could get that in a game like this. Get out of my way, human. Good morning, sir. There's a giant. Yes. Don't waste the time of the mutant. Let's wait a second before we pull that, because we're, you know, surrounded by everything. You, you're glad I'm finding except the future. Don't yeah, of waste the time of the mutant. Yes. Understood. Yeah. He's gonna flank me at like the worst time. So, I'm gonna pull him. The mutant obeys. No, walk in here. I guess the wave is over. What? Die. Let's go. Speak, my magic human. I think the mutant is allowed to die. I don't know, actually, though. Commander of Fortune Teller has repaired the clones, the clones' harpies from now. On every six hours, going ways of heart will spawn. Well, Die. that's unfortunate. E Him just dying is never good. Yeah. It might be that he's not allowed to die. I'm actually not sure. I guess it's too late to find out. I think we also have a main Titan though, so. Speak my Oh dear. Good morning, sir. Yes. I need to kill something. At your service. Our forces are in danger. What can I do for you, sir? Let's go. Get out of my way, humans! Easy! Okay! Our soldiers are in trouble. Time already? Units under attack. Easy. 
Okay. Understood. Another one down. My machine is ready. Where are the harpies coming from? I don't see them yet. Oh, I'm gonna deactivate the mutants because I don't want mutants spawning. Excuse me? Sniper is oh dear. Anything to destroy? And then we have most of this side what I want. Um I guess getting to the giants will take a while, so maybe we take the other sides first. Yeah, Henry. Hello. Um well that giant is a bit inconvenient. But I could get in here with the other group, but then you know. try to get through to the harpies like if we have that we got all the burst and then we clear it up from the back side i guess i could also get that beholder we need a bit more gold for it the giant. Well, since my troops are here. Let's do it, human. Great. Good. Yes. Die. Let's do it, human. Great. Hey. Don't try to add on the control. Oh dear. Yes. Wish we could get Die. more oil income. Anything to destroy? Come on. We will conquer the world. What? Yes. Anything to destroy? Uh, no, stopping that wave. A great machine for a great man. Our forces are in danger. The holder? Yes. Come on. What can I do for Our you, sir? Are in trouble.
don't need those either. And this is just holding like the yeah, you have enough to kill those. Then of the harpies. Hopefully it's not like ridiculous. I like I think I like this um, different spawn points for everything more than everything spawning in the same place, because now you can Sneak around or push against one of them. Can't capture them. The only thing I could capture were these um, executors up there and, and the list of hero there. Wait, why? That's where all my titans are, aren't right? yes. Come on! Finally, they lost the hopkeep group. Speak, my human. So these defenses should get a lot of um, less stress soon in a second too, even though they are better than ever. Anything to destroy? I wonder if you can run into here fast in the beginning and just get these extra resources. Like this is closer than this up there, so maybe pushing east is better for getting faster resources, but we disabled like mutants and stuff before it spawned, which yeah. Oh, I really don't want to deal with that. Mutants are the future. Seems like cleaning the spawns get easier with time. How would it be more fun? Um, I think that depends how much you snowball. What? Oh, 
and at which times. Like, I think it's really hard for the map maker to um, activate more spawns at the right time. Like, we got a thousand and three thousand gold mares, which boosts the early game quite a bit, even though I didn't play it great. Because I didn't know what uh, to expect or do. Get out of my way, humans. I risk the mutant. I shouldn't, but he's in this group here, I guess. Yes, we could send him back home. What can I do for you, sir? Jolly good. Hearing those will be a pain. Oh, I guess we can't kill Um, actually, I'm gonna pay the food this time. Because my troops are in the path here, I think, so I don't want to deal with that. Fantastic! I'm gonna Titan forward to tank here. I didn't lower the difficulty now. Excuse me? What can I do for you, sir? Hello. Let's go. Good morning, sir. Indeed. Our soldiers are in trouble. I guess if we're clearing this up there, we might as well Fantastic. go in there too. Let's go. Jolly good. Yes. Units under attack. Is it tea time already? Your sniper at your service. My machine is ready. Interesting. Our forces are in danger. Jolly good. Yeah, we have 14 more days to the clear everything. So tiny from up here. Our soldiers are in trouble. Need that food for a party. Actually, I'm stockpiling resources. I should still build stuff. Because just in case I don't clear everything in time and we have to defend the final wave. I wonder if the final wave depends on how much you um, destroyed spawn points or if it makes no difference. I feel like it should make a difference how much you cleared, but I'm not sure it's that implemented that way. Yeah, we could just be a bit more aggressive about destroying these things. Oh, it's true. I guess it said in the beginning it's 10k. Either way. But it could be 10k plus, you know. Or it could be 5k and then for every building you didn't destroy, oh, there's dear. another 1k or something. Yes. Hmm, we're getting food from here. Jolly good. Getting the warehouses. Good morning, sir. Oh, hello. I think the... those walkers... Oh, dear. Let's go. actually blocked the other zombies a bit. Oh, dear. In case I'm really low to the normal point. Yes, if it is 10k giants though, there's no way you're holding it. Pretty sure it's not, because you know. It's not completely insane when making maps. Hello, jolly good. Indeed, jolly good. Good idea, you have to admit. <laughs> wow. So, you usually don't, you know, think I have good enemies. Yeah. I like the design of the map though. I don't know. The, the beginning was quite rough again, but... I like that... Yeah. You can sneak around the waves and don't have to push against them all the time. You, you had to in the beginning, but like after the first two, you can sneak it a bit. Be smart about it. And you can disable what you worry about the most. Like for me, mutants and giants. More evil than actually. Oh, oh no, depending how you do it, yes. it's it's less. 
No, I, I think it's just it's more rewarding if like let's say you clear everything on the map except one one of the buildings oh dear. and then it makes no difference if you only cleared one or all of them obviously it makes a difference beforehand because you get more resources and it's less stressful but yeah. i like rewarding players for playing well oh, with killing this we should win Try to recreate a kind of cubes. Yeah, but I think this one is um it's less stressful, at least. And it's less pushing against waves all the time. I don't know. Because again you can walk around. I I don't know, I like the idea. I think it's nicely made. And let's end this. This madness is now over. My god. I must admit that this fortune teller will never cease to surprise us. But we are done with this place. Mount Olympus too now belongs to us, and the territory of the fortune teller is shrinking every day. We are slowly but surely approaching this landmark. We will have to redouble our efforts to reach it and defeat Felicia for good. I have no doubt about the outcome of this war. Together we will win it. However, there is something I do not understand. And she said that this world was full of similarities. What was she implying? Oh wait. The, the beginning was stressful because you don't know where the entry point is and I didn't realize I was pulling stuff with noise. I thought it was the waves in the beginning. I could have just moved the a bit back. But yeah. Yep. Yeah, I probably maybe would have just set up my defenses. Like I would have sold the executors and get an early game boost if I would play it again. And then make we make defenses to the right and to the west so you can you have more space to put units and it's also easier to push out you know just small stuff maybe we're not the only ones fighting the fortune teller in the world remember we've already seen her die in the swamps and yet there she was in front of us in flesh and blood would it be possible that she used the cloning facilities to clone herself that would be crazy but it wouldn't surprise me coming from the fortune teller with this whole phoenix project thing or idt whatever its name is We'd have to deal with other fortune tellers who might not look like her physically. For God's sake, and to say that we came here to find out where the mutants came from. And now here we are fighting in the old world of madness and killing clone clones who are clones themselves. Not to mention the mental control that the fortune teller can have on people infected with creeping plants. We'll have to end uh, the story. If the fortune teller was all powerful as she seems to claim, we would have had no chance. Exactly. That goes without saying. I think that the fortune teller has not yet reached her limits when it comes to control the infected. We didn't see any communicators here, and yet she controlled several hundreds or thousands infected at once. We cannot let her gain strength. We must trade fast and hard. And we will. Commander, one of our scout teams has reached the edge of the forest east of the marshes. We've established an outpost and are waiting for your orders. The first report confirms that there is absolutely no infected in the area, and no trace of the fortune teller. The scouts describe the place as silent, as if there were no life. Hopefully, we can settle down and establish a colony quietly before we attack. Mm -hmm. Yes, for sure. It's the fortune teller sticking our asses together. Not sure it's going to work out the way you expect it to, fresh flesh. But well, we've the right to dream. Oh, since we don't use the politician system. No need for our screenshots. Oh. Well, nice. 140,000 infected killed in 50 days. Not, not too bad, not too bad. Yeah, I probably could have used the Tenatos more aggressive in the beginning too with it. Um, you could so... Room for improvement, but we had nice mayors. I think those made up for things I could usually improve upon. <laughs>